to my surprise, some people are actually curious. How am I going to use these two on my little DIN contraption uh, with a longer cable? So I got here a 50 meter uh, Ethernet cable, which I'm going to connect up to these, which will literally connect to the back of the uh, Arduino. So I'm just going to connect it up. There's uh, no magic to it. At least not as far as I can see. You just plug these in. It can be one at a time. If I can get this to work today. That's one. Get the second one in. Can't really make it work today, can I? And the last two, I'll try and go with two in one go to save some time. Here we go. So that is one. Might as well connect it straight away to the relay, which I believe is the high pin here and the amber and the yellow sorry and the amber to be the last one here so that that's this should act as my uh, as my uh, Arduino for the relay control and the other one obviously is the uh, sensor which will trigger whenever something's in front of it at least like 20 centimeters I've done a, dem done a demonstration of, of that before I'll probably include it somewhere up there for you to check out so here we are now the last two we're kind of nearly there it's nearly done if I can just manage to get them to in bolt it down just a bit nothing too hard for okay so these are in gonna move that back a little slide this bad boy in get these uh, these connected one two Okay, this should be now nearly done. Connect the power here. And the power here, here we go. Power it up. Here it goes nothing. There you have it. Yeah, nice and easy. You know the rest of the drill. This is working over uh, 50 meter ethernet cable and this is how we can use it uh, in a house or any other setting or a garden etc etc okay that's it uh, hopefully this helps someone to uh, visualize how this will work and uh, as you can tell it's rather straightforward the modbus standard doesn't care really if it's over 50 meters it manages just fine so yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. Cheers.